Turn reactions are currently trailing the verdicts of the presidential election petitions tribunal that affirmed Bola Tinubu winner of the 2023 election. While the APC has described it as a judgment that reaffirmed the mandate of its candidate, the candidate of the People's Democratic Party, Atiku Abubakar, is prepared to approach the Supreme Court to set aside the election of President Bola Tinubu. Our correspondent, Habida Lawal, has more on this. All the five members of the presidential election petition tribunal on Wednesday unanimously affirmed Bola Ahmed Tinubu as the elected president of Nigeria, a decisive judicial resolution of the credibility questions that have hovered around his election for over five months. In an over 12-hour long judgment, the panel of judges led by Justice Aruna Samani dismissed all three petitions challenging the president's election. The APC has applauded the appellate court verdict, describing it as a win for democracy. A poker judgment has reinforced our democracy and underscored the vibrancy and independence of the judiciary. The, the, the judgment has also reinforced that our party won and emphatically won the presidential election on February 25, 2023, beyond any doubt. The same cannot be said for the PDP candidate who is challenging the appeal court judgment at the Supreme Court. It is a judgment that I refuse to accept. I refuse to accept the judgment because I believe that it is bereft of substantial justice. Consequently, I have asked my lawyers to activate my constitutionally guaranteed rights of appeal to the higher court. It is to force pronouncement on some of these unacceptable ethical issues for the love of the country and its future generation. I also call on members not to lose focus and be distracted. The NWC is doing everything possible to keep this party together so that we will give this government a credible opposition. And we will continue to pursue our mandate. Both Atiku Abubakar and Peter Obi have indicated their intentions to appeal against the judgment at the Supreme Court, which is the final arbiter on presidential election matters. Habib Alawal, TVC News, Abuja. All right, then, uh, so much to talk about, so much to chew on. Uh, we'll be, I'll be talking to uh, a public affairs analyst, Cheson Okwande, who is in the studio with me. Thank you so much for coming on The Breakfast Show. Good morning, uh, Shita, and good morning to all our viewers. Thank God it's Friday. Thank God it's Friday. It's good to see you. And thank God it's uh, politics in the air as well. For, of course. For we us just to talk have about. to talk it out <laughs> and uh, give our perspective, even though we are not learned like the learned fellows. But at least uh, see, give us a Amazing. So I've got a learned fellow uh, and a political analyst, Tunji Abdul Hamid. It's good to have you. Thank you for having me. It's my pleasure to be here. Mm, yeah. Great. So um, let me start with you. What do you make of the, because reactions are definitely betraying uh, the aftermath of the, the judgment of the uh, tribunal uh, of the court, uh, you know, affirming the victory of President Bola Ahmed Tinubu. The parties, PDP, have been, has been saying that they will definitely go to the Supreme Court as well as the Labour Party, that they will be approaching the Supreme Court. What do you make of all of this? Yeah, well, that, I think um, appealing the judgment is not a new thing and it's not abnormal. It is a right, and uh, which uh, anyone that is aggrieved should be able to uh, 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 take a chance to, 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 to see whether he can get a for that justice at the, at, the, at the hem of their fear, and that was Supreme Court. So, I, of course, I see people criticizing and saying, why would you go appeal there? Why would they go? They want to go and waste their money. No, and that's why we're not growing this country, because we don't like taking chances and uh, trying to exploit all the possibility that is, uh, that is around us. We just like to just keep like that. You see, for me, that judgment for me, the key point there for me is that, look, it shows that, look, as a petitioner, in the election, particularly in, in election generally, but in particular, presidential election petition, it's an, a, a clear task for you to win. It is a, good, a, a difficult task. That is what that judgment showed to me, that because the, the burden placed on the, on the petitioner 
is so enormous that it will be difficult for him to be able to achieve those 18. More so, some of the things that the, the petitioner will be required to rely on will, be, will have to be collected from an, the, the, a, 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 another uh, opposition. When I say opposition here now, I'm talking about the defendant, one of the defendants, INEC. Mm -hmm. Some of the material that will be used to buttress your case, which we call evidence, will, INEC must give you some of those uh, documents. So how do you expect INEC, who that are challenging his authority, to cooperate with you in that regard? Well, as a lawyer, you know that the burden of proof is, is you know, incumbent upon the petitioner to be able to, you know, convince the court that this is the reason why I'm, you know, bringing this petition, and then this is the reason why I need you to see based on my own perspective. But if you're not able to prove, just like one of the judges said, they won't get to the street to look for evidences for you. And that's, that's exactly what I'm saying, that for you to, it will be difficult, if not impossible, for any petitioner in an election petition, particularly presidential petition, uh, election petition, to win his case, in, in few of that uh, burden that has been placed on him, he needs to establish certain things. And most of the things that he will, he will rely on to establish his case will be from the, 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 the from INEC. It's going to be difficult. And we will all see how uh, the, some of the party complain that they were frustrated by INEC. It's part of the tactics. And that's why. Some of the evident witnesses by, by, by what's it called, the Labour Party, were not accepted. So for me, that is, that is, that is, that is, that is one of the things that I see there. It's, 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 it's going to be, it's, it's going to be difficult, instance, if not impossible, for what, what were some of the things? Uh, uh, what were some of the things that were supposed to be brought or to be collected from INEC to present to the court in order to advance their own arguments? No, in line with the law and according to the judgment, if you are alleging, for example, irregularity, if you are alleging irregularity or manipulation of results, what you are required to do is to highlight those number of votes that you have in the particular unit, the number of votes that has been taken away from you, the one that has been manipulated or, or the irregularity that, that is there. So if, assuming you are now alleging irregularity in 1,000 polling units, it means that you have to call a witness, a witness each from that polling unit to come and establish that fact. Where, where is the time to do that? And so what, what, what where is the, the other where is, way around? To, to, to where is the time to do that? You see, the, if, the, the other way around, the way that this can be done, I, I'm aware that this uh, uh, presumption of, uh, of regularity mm -hmm. from the part of INEC. In other words, once election is conducted, and INEC announces his results, no matter what he has done, the law presumes that he has done the right thing. So until that is taken away, and the body is placed on the INEC, to show that, look, this election I, it was done in line with the law. But unfortunately, what I see again in that judgment is that they are giving INEC the power to do whatever, whatever he likes. And then they, whatever he declare is considered as a result. Because uh, that's what they say. They say they, they, because the, some of the position of the law says, uh, for example, in terms of uh, transmission, say the transmission has been determined by INEC. I remember when that, if, if, you can, if you follow me that time, when that law was passed, I was one of those who raised that issue, that this is a recipe. Or disaster that giving any discretion to determine uh, the, the mode of uh, transmission mm. is an opportunity for INEC for a, a INEC officer who wants to do uh, what we call Magomago. Mm. He wants to do well, well, maybe that's your opinion because no, I say, uh, no, I say it's an opportunity for any any any, any INEC officer, but there is no proof. Who, to say I, that I'm not INEC saying this, INEC. I'm not talking right. about this particular INEC. I'm saying for, for anybody who mm. wants to, if you have a mind of uh, doing uh, what you call the wrong okay, thing, I'll, I'll definitely that will come. give you an opportunity. To do the wrong thing because the law says it is you that will. How can you say? How can you now? And that's an area I, I disagree with in that judgment. I disagree with that area in that judgment of that of the, of the Supreme Court. I, I respect their industry. I respect what they have done. I respect that they have done what. But they are not. They are not Alpha and Omega. They are not judges because. Well, bear they in mind all. that INEC, INEC is an independent commission, and then they they have the uh, exclusive right to be able to dis to, to determine I agree with exactly you. I agree with so you. So we'll, we'll pick let, on let that me, let, me, let me clear that. Let me right. clear that. Let me clear that. I won't allow you to go with that. They have the right to. But the law also say INEC, uh, by constitution, the constitution under section 160, mm. gives INEC the power to make its own regulation. The section 147 of the Electoral Act gave INEC the power to, to make its regulation to regulate the conduct of election. Before the, every election, INEC will come out with, with regulations and guidelines. Why would the court not say INEC has the power to at any time discount it? How can you make a promise and, 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 and how can you change the, the, the rule of the game 
in the middle of the game. If the guy so that is what the law, that's what the judgment has said. The judgment said, INEC had the right to do anything like it. You can say this tomorrow, today, at the, at, the, at the start of the election, and the, in the night of the election, you can say, no, we are not doing this again. Okay. That is not proper. That is, that's, 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 that's not proper. We'll, we'll definitely pick up, okay, pick up on that point, you know, as soon as I come back to you. But the thing is, you know, you've been following the, the whole development, you know, from the elections to when the petitions were laid before the, before the court, and then the, the, the judgment being uh, given by, by the Presidential Election Petitions Court. Uh, what do you make of you know, the aftermath of the whole thing, reactions from these parties, and what you think should be the way forward? Yeah, first and foremost, uh, let me state here that uh, my learned uh, friend has actually given certain submission. And uh, the reason why some of us opted out to study law is the complexity of it when the issue comes up and opt to be, you know, man of the figure. But uh, be that it may, uh, I want to first acknowledge uh, the work of the judges of the PPC. Uh, to me, as an accountant uh, who has uh, knowledge in audit, we we'll see that a thorough job has been done. And if I want to go by the word of we accountant, where we are presenting our financial statement, I say show a true and fair view of uh, what that uh, stuff should be. I listened to it from 9 a.m. At uh, the time, I missed at around 2 to 3 to attend the meeting, came back and finished to it, and I looked at the task and uh, the, the volume of uh, work committed uh, to the submission. Uh, from what my brother said, uh, a learned person, first and foremost, if you are to petition, uh, from the aspect of we, the financial person, you must have some facts at your back. It's like an auditor trying to challenge someone who has actually carried out something, and you are coming before the management to say, I have this without evidence. If I am going to petition, and I know that the books that you are keeping is with the management I need to extract figure, I must have something to counter it. And that's what you're saying. He's saying that uh, the law stipulates that if you have 1,000 misappropriation or you know, misrepresentation of figures that you are contesting, you have to present individual you know, person for each pulling board. That is what it implies. Because I cannot speak for you. You actually endorse it. That's why they said in the law, electoral law, at the ward, at the, at the polling unit, you have a representative of all the political parties, who endorses the uh, 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 result of the election before transmitting to the world, before they get to the local government, to the states. At what point in time, if there were differences, did we have any of those people? Then you should be able to say, I have this fact here that uh, this particular person said this was altered, he did not sign, or he signed, and basic thing. One thing we should realize is that we are not in the Stone Age. But, but you realize that um, it, whatever it is, whatever results that you have, yeah. all the party agents, they've got their own uh, copies. Of and course. If they allege any regular irregularities, they should, be, they should be able to also present the copies that they got from, from INEC. Exactly where I'm going, that when you are not taking that, that is your own proof to say that what INEC has, uh, is reporting is different from what I have, and that is my fact. So it's not something that you say, submit on a central database and say somebody should speak to it. Aside that you'll be speaking to that document that you are actually presenting to defend your case before the court. It is only you that can explain it. I cannot explain a pulling boot where a uh, uh, barrister Abdullah me, you know, represent. Because what would I be saying? If, to, if, if I'm to just post that document, I will be able to explain to them to say, see, while we were there, sincerely speaking, 25 people came. 15 of them were black. 10 of them were, you know, of another color. 10 of them were wearing native. Of, that will reinforce my submission to defend that document that I'm actually moving against. And definitely, I think we bring their own position. But here we are talking about 27 out of several. And I know what the law stipulates, even though I'm not a lawyer, you, you that you should have substantial, you know, a, 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 a submission. Mm. And with that, it's not a perfect system that we're looking for yet, but substantial submission to make that thing work. And why I give kudos to this uh, 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 verdict is that you've run through those uh, areas 
We've seen submission where the evidences were downloaded on social media uh, without uh, substantially, you know, having the evidence from the right source. And we are bringing that before the court of law. Even I myself, that I'm not a lawyer, if you bring it to our community meeting, where we preside on, I will definitely yes, need sir, it. Yes, right. And that is so, why, that is why, that is the exact, exact why, the reason why I said that responsibility should be on the INEC. In you know other words, INEC conducted the election. Yeah. He has a result with him. Why not compare, why not make it a duty for INEC that you must bring this result to us without even me asking for it? Okay, so. But no, the fact remains, Abdul Admi. No, the fact. But the issue is this. Yeah. There's a conflict between what I have presented that mm. I said you gave to me from the one INEC presented. And they will be taken, will, will, will be recognized. They will, they will, they, 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 see, authentic. for me, they will not take you good like and sink no, you see, so, see, they won't take it. If, if you, you have your if submission. You, if, you want, if, you want, if you want our progress in our electoral system, yeah. we should advocate that this, this uh, uh, evidence that will be required, yeah. that will be required to support your evidence in court, should be a, a, a mat, as a matter of, uh, 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 what's it called? Uh, not even me asking for it. As a matter of a, a it should be there for people it, to. You act. must be able to. Like, but see, you aside it, that you I present it, no, Abdul Ami. If, if it's not, if I don't, if I don't ask you for it mm. as INEC, since you know it will be useful for me, you may not even bring it to court. But if, the, cannot, if, it's, if it's mandated that look, INEC must make sure that all materials used for this process without me asking for it must be before the court for that for us yeah, to so attend. So what about what? Okay. That will help. That will help. What about what about the IREV? You know, we all clamor to have access to the IREV. And all of these reports, um, all of these um, uh, results were uploaded into the IRA. Why not? The IRA. And that no, was the problem. Not, uh, not simultaneous. Not at the time Nigerians were looking forward to it. But you have everything now uh, uploaded to, to the IRA. So um, is, it not, is it not enough proof to show transparency no, that I, the documents you're looking for, which largely uh, are, the, uh, are the results, it, it, they are already... It is enough proof that it must be before the court. How, do we, how will it get to the court? Then, that is the problem. That's, that's even Shita, what I want so to pick... Be, uh, it will be the responsibility of INEC to ensure that all those materials are before the court without even me asking for it. I will ask for it. You will prevent me from... You will not give it to me. I will not be able to present it before the court. And the court will not say, I do not bring enough evidence. That is not... Like... like uh, you know, uh, 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 Abdul Hamid, I'm, like, like, I'm not a lawyer. Like, I can only talk. Uh, uh, I'm not... What the auditor that can't? Yeah. The company refused to give you the necessary material. How will you audit? So are you saying no? That what what what, I, what I'm saying, yeah. Abdullah? Me, I'm not a lawyer all here. All but, no, no, but what? Let, let me get, let me say Sorry. this. Let me yeah. make it clear. Let me okay. Say, I'm not I'm not saying the judges did not do that. They've not done the uh, diligence. They, they did. They they, 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 they I, I respect their industry mm -hmm. and they have done their best. Judges are not alpha and omega. They are not they are not judges because they know it all. Because you are a judges, lawyer. Are, For they us, are, they are, they they are, are small judges, gods. Not because whatever they they are judges, they are, they are, they, we respect their, their, their decision because the, the authority is on them that whatever they say is fine now. Because we assume because that they, they have gone through okay, the okay, thoroughness okay, of they what should be. Their position must be right at all time. TJ, uh, uh, let, let me state this, Barista Abdul Ami. As I'm not a lawyer, but I can bring, I can infer certain things when it comes to issue, when they bring it before you as a leader in the community and some area. When they bring you are saying, when they bring it before you. As a petitioner, I am coming to tell you that this thing this person has done, I am not in support of it. It's wrong. I must have an evidence that I will pre present before you challenging what you have actually submitted. I'm, I'm, I don't know the position of it in the law. Now you have brought it before me to say this is what I feel should be. Honors will I rely on me to invite the person you are petitioning. Can I have your own position right. and compare figures? I'm talking basically as an accountant. As a layman. Come I, in I, I and, as a layman. Compare figure. And don't forget, things are actually taking certain steps. If you are not sure of what we have, we don't have what we call forensic. That is a step ahead of the physical thing that we talk about. Can we go ahead and say some of the things that you have submitted? But we were even made to understand from the, uh, 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 the verdict declared by the judges that some of the things presented by Labour Party, so they were blurry. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. How do you expect that to make so use of it? When they are it? blurry, who, who should have the one that is not blurry? Why can't you have the right one that is not blurry to contest what I have? You see, you see, you see, we are talking... You must, if, you, if you are coming to petition me, if you are saying what I've done you see, is wrong, you, see, you must have facts. We are talking law here. 
And you see the... You see, I, I, that's why I said I'm not a lawyer. But I know there are certain if, things if that I, I just... Come. Let, let, let us take it one after If year. I am the petitioner, yeah. Yeah. what you don't know about law, and that mm. is that is, and that was, that was what APC did in their petition. You can, you can, if you recall, they call only one witness or two. I can't remember. It's only one or two. As a, as a defender in the court, in the case, I'm not, I, I may not even present any document. I, I can just... What, the body, once they say the body is on, on the petitioner, mm. so that what, I must be the one to bring everything. So as an INEC, that is also in support of my, of my case. If I am able to bring those documents, and he has a document in his custody, he will not bring it. And because and it's, all, it, and it's all under, under obligation to bring it. So I'm not saying the law should make it mandatory if we truly were looking for justice. Well, uh, 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 I said I'm not a lawyer. Uh, that we are looking for technicality now. If we are looking for justice, fast. we should ask the ANEC to always bring those documents before the court, whether with or without me asking for this. Hey, Barrister Abdul, I mean, I'm not a lawyer, but I want to believe that. Let me talk as a layman, common sense. Mm. You are coming oh, no, with your fat. Wait now. Mm. I know, uh, that's why I know the technicality are so huge. People like us run for it and go for finance. Mm. The issue is you have presented certain facts to defend yourself. I don't think that the judge will come and give their verdict without scrutinizing that's or asking questions from the defendant. No, Inek is one of the that, that, that is not our law, uh, our court. So it's, it's the presumed court, the court, that... The court, the court works based on what you present. If you, if you like, if you know this will be useful for you, yeah. and you fail to present it, it is not the duty of the court to say, why did you not bring this one? Of course, nobody oh, will ask that. Even, no, even without is, court, so, even so, without court, Abdullah so even audit, as persona, if auditing, persona. If you are auditing, uh, and you know that this document will be useful, we will not ask for it. That it's, is not, it's, not like, it's, not, it's not like that in law. Because for me, I am going to defend that document, the financial then, statement. Then so, so, but, but then, let, like let, us look at, let us look at what some of the, uh, some of the, um, uh, the Leonard Silks, what they said, especially one who had been in, a, in the profession, a law profession for years, for decades, that's talk about, talk about Robert it Clark. He said that... It's not about the number of years. Uh, uh, well, this is an it's opinion. Not, it's not, no, I'm not and then you to react, you react based on... But I have been there on... for a long of years, I respect them. Absolutely. It does not mean he has a monopoly of knowledge or... So this is the point I'm trying to make. Well, but for you know, us, he said, we respect such he, he in our said, profession. We understand what is going on. Is that is the case. <laughs> no, no, no lawyer... Would you allow me to... Would you allow me to present this to you? Robert Clark said that, you know, he admitted that in several over several decades, of his practice, that this petition court was thorough and did a very good job. He said that, you know, so do you think that these judges would have, you know, uh, got these accolades mainly because the process was witnessed by millions of people no, home and get, abroad? Get, get my and point. seeing get my all right. the, 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 the grit and, you know, and tenacity in presenting this judgment to us in a lucid form, even for a layman to understand please, some get, of these things. Please get my position right. They, they are thorough, yes. They did a good job, and they did a, 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 a well-assigned job, yes. Then what I'm saying is that the fact that you have done a good job does not make it what you have done the right thing. Sometimes, most Based right on where you're not. looking at it from. Yes, exactly. I'm looking for, that's why we're, that's, how, right. that's why the law, two plus two may not be four, mm. in, all, in all cases. So, and that's why I like law. One, this, this way to, can lead to this market, and, and, and another way can lead to the same market. Mm. So, I, the fact that I, I respect that, they, they did, in fact, I, I want to recommend that, the uh, Guinness Book of Record right. to, to, to even recognize them because I've never seen any judgment that as long as that in my entire career, in, in, not only in Nigeria. Right. In the, I've, not, I've not heard of any judgment that has lasted for that kind of uh, hour. So, judge, judge, judgment, I mean, judge, what, what do you call it? <laughs> let's, 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 let's recommend them to the. Uh, so, uh, so, so, seriously, seriously mm -hmm. speaking, now, the fact that uh, I, I respect, they, they did, they, they did in industrial, industrial they, they did well in terms of mm -hmm. a thorough job. They did. Uh, uh, they, they they analyzed all the issues. But what I'm saying is that the fact that they analyzed all the issues and they did a thorough job does not mean that all the things they have said must be right. Mm. They are human beings. We are, we are, they are human beings. So you see, like I said earlier on, the fact that you are a judge does not mean because some people are making that mistake. Uh, no, no. The does fact not mean that you are a judge, like all knowing that you know just, everything, just like and whatever just like, you say must be correct. Just like no. Sheson Okwadi said, you know, the fact that you are a judge does not because we are humans, we are infallible. Yes, I but you them. won't you won't give judgment based on your sentiments. You will give judgment based, based on the facts on the fact that, that you have on ground. Uh, you and, see, and that you is see, what we had seen. Uh, 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 and, sometimes, and sometimes those, those judgments you are giving based on the fact and the law sometimes depend on your own uh, thinking as well. The way you are looking at it, sometimes that means how you uh, could how, you give an example. You, oh, sorry, could okay. you give example, example. Of, uh, for example? Let me give another example on, the, on those uh, in that judgment. Mm. I, I've just I've, I mentioned one regarding the uh, issue of uh, transmission. 
that I disagree with them the way they analyze it. In the sense that they came to the conclusion that will give INEC the power to do whatever. But that is the Constitution. INEC has the has the exclusive the right, the prerogative when, to when, 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 issue guidelines. When the law says that you have a discretion, mm. that discretion must be exercised judicially and judiciously. It's not that you just, you just you, can you can you be playing can you can we can FIFA make a rule regarding football, and in the middle of the ball when they when they were uh, 45 minutes ahead or 50 minutes ahead. Now change the rules. And let's, say, let's demystify, they have the right let's demystify this. How it be, it let's demystify this. No. You know, the, 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 the in electoral was, act. In that code was, in fact, in so many fora, said that, look, this is the, how the election will be conducted. Let me ask the you same this. Same now, Anek now renege on, his, on, his, on, his, on, on that. You now say it's just a mere problem. Barista, let me, no. ask, let me ask you this question. No, you're encouraging the Barista, sorry, sorry. Let, me, and, 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 let me ask you this question. Okay. If I promise you anything, I say, I, I promise you, I promise to give you this, I promise to give you that. There is an electoral, there is an act existing act, the constitution that is there. But I'm promising you, and my promissory notes has even gone beyond what the, uh, what the, the provision of the act. So if it I fail to... I'm, 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 I'm not, trying not, to Let me you, correct you. It did not go beyond. So that we won't, don't, 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 don't or within the ambit, within the ambit within of the, the act. Okay. And if I, if I, if I, if I uh, don't honor that, um, that, that, that promise, does that mean that, and then it goes against the provision of the yes, act? Yes. Does that mean because, that I've run foul of the law? Because the guideline that was rolled out by INEC yeah. was rolled out not just because they want to roll it out. But in this because case. Because the law says they must roll it out. But in this okay, case, okay, I'm not saying, saying, sorry, not saying, sorry, sorry, not saying that I can, give, I can roll out. And people, people, some people will participate in that election because of the guideline. Say, ah, look, since they're going to do this, I have confidence in it. But the coalition now, of now, is now, exclusively you know, stated that it will be it will be collated, it will be done manually. manually. It is clear. We are also but told that IREV will be used. It's part of it. You can't, IREV you can't, was you used can't, now. Can't one, BJ, BJ. Uh, no, oh, no, no, no. IREV was not used for the presidential. Barry Statunji, this is an area. Let me give another idea. No, sorry. Wait. This is an area. This is an area I have challenged a lot of people. Let him. And we should not misrepresent things. IREV was used. And no, what IREV does was to whether pro, it, was what, it was used. When, when, what when IREV was stipulates. When, was, was it, when, 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 when was the date that the thing was fully fully uploaded? But it was not incumbent when, that, upon that IREV to wait. Okay. For what what that was, was the circumstances? That it, that it no. What was, the circumstances? what was the circumstances? What was the circumstances that devoid that thing to be run immediately? We don't know it today. We know uh, because there uh, were serious. It was written. I next said it. There were serious means of attacking and the same, reporter. The same reporter. And at that point let in time, learn. let him learn. At that point in time, if people that are vast, at least IT wise, I have those basic knowledge. If you are going to see an evil coming, an attack on your database, some, you have every right let, at that let, point let in time. There's and that's why when you are developing a platform or you are developing app. You, there is this queuing system mm. that when you upload anything, is I, I have an app that runs for me in my organization. That when you go ahead and capture something and there is no network, it captures it, it queues it up. When you get to a place where there is internet, whether it's one day, two days, it starts uploading on it. So I start delivering. Same is obtainable when we use our phone. You will send some messages. Maybe at that area, there is no network. Do we, what, first and foremost, I think. I neck, I will blame them that they gave promises not relying on the infrastructure that we have. I'm not putting in place that there will be failure. But okay. they're supposed to put that clause there that the platform we have has a queuing policy in such a way that you can upload, it may not deliver. If I observe that you're going to attack my system, I have the right to shut it yes, down for that moment and system, queuing up. But that attack did not prevent them from uploading Cine okay, so you know, you know, barista, barista, the same time, the same day, the same IRA. And they were able, they were able to, they were able to upload. Could you allow me? And rep, but that of presidential the attack only affect that one. Barista same, Tunji, same system. Barista Tunji, you know, there, there are so many issues. Aye. There are so many issues, you know, that uh, that greeted these elections, uh, and this is just made beyond the transmission of election results. One of the issues uh, is that uh, the twenty-five percent uh, Abuja does not give Abuja, and Abuja does not hold. Uh, special status. Special status. He does not. So, what's your reaction to that? Because we've always uh, been made to believe that oh, without Abuja, if you don't win Abuja, you can't be you can't be president. You see, How do you react? You see, to for that? me, well, that's another area I, I also disagree. I disagree in the sense that the, that particular word that you use, uh, Abuja giving special uh, status. status, it is what what carries what carries uh, the judges away from the real issue. The real issue is not whether or not Abuja, Abuja was given a, a special status. The real issue is what? What is the position of the law? What the law does the law require 
Abuja to be not at the because what we're talking about here, we're talking about interpretation of the law. Mm. Yeah. Not 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 the 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 what it will, what it will lead to because what people are saying that. Uh, so in that case, are you saying Abuja is now a special? Uh, it's now the it's only got person, special that, privileges to use. That is not the issue right before the court. The issue before is that whether look at this law. And what does the law say? What does the law say? Does the law for me, for me, yeah. for me, for my own interpretation. Yeah. That law requires that uh, that you must at least win win uh, what's it called? Twenty five percent in Abuja. FCT in Abuja because the law clearly stated that thirty six state and, and our, if we look at our constitution. Those are the states were clearly stated. But the body started. Section 299 that they were referring to. Section 299. 299, sorry. That they were referring to. All this talk about Abuja as a state when it comes to administration of Abuja. And that's why you talk. It, 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 people will read and they will, they will, leave, they will leave those parts. Okay, sorry, about, sorry. Uh, so, sorry. Listen, listen section, section 299 says the provision. Can, can, can we all listen? The provisions of this constitution shall apply to the federal territory Abuja. Uh, Federal Capital Territory Abuja, as if it were one of the states of the Federation. It, 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 continue. Right, and, and uh, A says, all the legislative powers and executive powers and the judicial powers vested in the House of Assembly, the governor of a state and in the court of the state shall respectively vest in the National Assembly uh, the uh, president of the Fed Federation and in the courts, which by virtue of the foregoing provisions are court established uh, for the federal capital territory. So all power referred to in paragraph A of this section shall be exercised in accordance with the provisions of this as constitution. To Abuja. So he's talking about administration of Abuja as a state, as a FCT, mm. not, not because he's... he's, he's so the, what, what most people are reading those areas, the one you read, the ABC that you read, they will not, they will not give it to you because you know people will not go and read it. Well, but, they read those but, but there is section, and they, and they Bob Bar Barista, section, and they Bob Barista. And they, and they, and Even this time they we are talking that how many states do we have in Nigeria? We, have we say we have thirty-six states and Abuja. And Abuja. Right. Yes. So that does not give. Why, them do you, why, do you, why did you not just say we have thirty-seven states? Well, it is Abuja those, thirty-seven states. Those that actually do the constitution. Why did you not say? Know so? the reason for that, but I don't think there is anything see, that give that special preference mm. that Abuja you must have twenty-five percent. That without Abuja, Abuja, so so you cannot. So so logically, we should consolidate it because it's not about like giving Abuja special status. It, it, that, it, that it, is, that's that what it is. No, that's what they sell to you people. No, that no, no. What that sorry, sorry. Lo logically, Barista Blani. They are giving Abuja, Abuja special status. That, 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 that is what, what it important. implies. Barista Blani. But that's logically, what you don't if you, if you don't win any, any state, for instance, and then you won Abuja 25%, mm. does that... So because you have to win Abuja, and you are the only one who has it's won not Abuja... You are not winning 25%. That, that is, is, is part Abuja, of it. It's part of and it. And you have less than the, uh, 10 you states. You are not qualified. So what becomes... So what will not become the result? So what is, let, what let is let your let grounds? Let's let assume that that judgment nullified election of a judge. Mm. Article and the LB will not be declared. Except, except, except if they review the results, the numbers of uh, people, yeah. and they now realize that they, they've got in the... So they're not, they're not saying, once you win Abuja, you are the winner of election. Okay, so, so Barista Blami, because of our time, no. because of our time, let me, let we, we are bringing this to a close. Let me, let me, no, no. Let me address the another point, point that I know. The point another point raise. I want to raise has to do with nomination for vice president. Mm. That one too, I disagree. Well, because you also encourage the institution whereby... If I'm a P APC of APC, I have a candidate I nominated. Mm. That candidate is not from Nigeria, it's from Cameroon. I'm in PDP and I'm aware that this, this person is not in Nigeria. I cannot say anything. Vice Tabla Amid, as, as we go, as, the party, as, the, as your party, Vice Tabla proper. Vice Tabla Amid, no, as your, pa not sorry, proper, sorry, as your party goes to the proper. Supreme Court, as they go to the Supreme Court, what are the things that you think they should be you know, laying on the table? The cards that they need to be playing, on the, they need to play on the table before... Uh, the, the judge at the Supreme Court. Now, unfortunately, the Supreme Court is not a court where you can do, you go and give further evidence. Mm. The Supreme Court will only look at the at the at the judgment given by the by the because what you'll be doing at the, at the Supreme Court yeah. is to show where the error in those judgments mm. and to see whether or not it was properly done. So, unfortunately, I will not be expecting anything different from the Supreme Court. All right. So, so, so it, it means that you already you already ask, accept your party already accepted defeat. Is that what the point you're trying no, to make? No, I'm not no, saying. It's not saying, saying that, but at least as an I'm individual, I say, as an individual, my opinion, opinion. <laughs> I say from, 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 <laughs> from where I grew up, Nigeria. All right. So, so your your, your, your final thoughts. We are, we are actually out of time. Your final thoughts. You know, as we yeah, my final thought is uh, kudos to the judges for this that they have done. Uh, for the first time, people like us can see what the proceeding looks like. Uh, like uh, my friend said, the longest. Mm. Now we can see the truth. The, what the uh, social media brought up before this judgment, all eyes on judiciary. 
We have seen them now. Mm. And people like us who are not learning, mm. still learning, give kudos to them. Mm. Let them continue to protect the law and uh, give the right thing. And I know that Nigeria will get there one day. Thank you very much, um, gentlemen. Well, this is an ongoing conversation, and then we'll still keep having this conversation, and it still informs what we discuss you know, on uh, the next um, uh, issues we'll be looking at. Uh, thank you so much, Public Affairs Analyst, Cheson Okwade. Thank you so much for your keenness of insight. Thank you. And much. also a lawyer and political analyst who has got a lot of issues to pick from the judgment, uh, Tunji Abdul Hamid. Don't worry, we'll see how the whole thing pans out at the end of the day. Thank you very much, thank you very thank much you very gentlemen. Much.